Welcome UST Northern members. This is the first in a series of short little video clips on how things are done regarding USTA Junior Sanctioned Tournaments within USTA Northern. And this first clip is on how draws are made within our section for junior tournaments. Also want to mention that each particular tournament is responsible for making the draws. The section office does not partake in making any particular draw for any tournament. Our first order of business is to actually get the players entered on our Tournament Data Management System, or TDM, which is a software that runs every tournament within our section, which is also linked with Tennis Link, where you register for that tournament. Once the tournament is closed and registrations have been processed, players are then downloaded to the system, and you'll see those players in this particular tournament here uh, in, in the players box. And this is the Gustavus Holiday Classic from last year, level six. Things have changed a bit because we're obviously going to be using some different lists from 2011. Uh, you'll notice 15 players. Our first order of business is then to seed the event. So we're going to go to auto seed. This pulls up a, another box for us to seed the event. And regarding seeding, the ratio for seeding is a one to three ratio by a power of two. And what that equates to is you're going to have either two seeds four seeds, eight seeds, or 16 seeds. Never anything different than those particular numbers. Any event can have a minimum of two seeds. In this case, with 15 players, we're going to have four seeds. So we need to search first for the list that we're going to use, and in this case, it's our current ranking list of 228-2011. So we're gonna click that on. We'll click OK. It then asks us how many players we want to seed. Again, with 15 players, we're going to have four seeds. So we'll plug in a number four here, click OK, and it says automatic seeding complete. And if we go back down to the players box, you'll notice that it shows our four seeded players here. Simple as that. Next process is to make the actual draw. And up top, we have a draw icon. So we're going to click that on, and then we're going to go up to the draw tab and once we click that on it's going to ask us to make the draw. So we'll click make draw and this analyzes everything, uh, the, the templates in there, the seeds and so on and then it lets us know that the request is complete. We'll click close and as you can see our draw is made. We're going to minimize this a little bit for you to better view it. Let me just increase that just a bit here. You'll notice we have our four seeded players in red. And you will always have your number one seed up top. Your number two seed will always be at the bottom. Those are always fixed. All your remaining seeds are at random. In this case, our number three seed is in the top half of the draw on line number five. And our number four seed is on line number 12 in the bottom half of the draw. And you can always refer to your friend at court which is the official rules of tennis, which you can get at usta.com for all the particular elements regarding seeding. Once the draw is done, this is what you see online. When you go in to check the tournament, your draw times, your start times, everything, this is what you're seeing that's posted online. And the tournament then uploads this. They go back to the file tab, and there's a little link here that says upload to tennis link. When the tournament director hits that, that is uploaded and visible on Tennis Link for everyone to see. And that's first in our series of how draws are made in USTA Northern.